What's going on guys, welcome to the video. So, a lot has happened since the last time I saw you. It's been just about a week, but it's been the craziest, most hectic, busiest, and also best week of my entire life. Uh, so I'm in a fantastic mood. I'm excited to share all the good news with you, as much as I can share. But uh, but yeah, first I gotta drive home. I gotta drive this U-Haul back home. First big news is I have my little daughter right here. This is Scarlett Rose Sheldon. She was born six days ago and uh, she weighed seven pounds, 12 ounces. She's perfect. She's passing all the tests. She looks great. She's sleeping. Okay, so it could be better, but not bad. But uh, yeah, it, honestly, this was like the best thing that has ever happened in my life. I already love being a father. It's a lot of work already, but it's so much fun, and it's it's just she's just so cute already. <laughs> Look at her. So she's here, and that happened on like I said on Monday. So we went to the hospital on Sunday, last Sunday, because um, Mimi was getting a lot of contractions, and they were ramping up. We went to the hospital. We stayed there overnight, and then Scarlett popped into this world at like 5:51 in the morning on the 16th of January. So that is the first big big news of the video and Mimi's doing very well as well. She's uh, recovering well, she's a bit sore, but no complications, it was very smooth and uh, she's pretty much even happier than I am if you can't even be happier than me for uh, little Scarlet. <laughs> the second piece of big good news is two days after Scarlet Rose was born, um, I actually signed a contract with a team. I don't know if it's gonna be announced yet. If it is announced, then you guys already know that I signed with If it's not announced yet, then I'll just bleep over it and you guys will find out soon enough. So basically, it's been so hectic because not only have I had to deal with, you know, getting used to the routine of feeding and sleeping and, and trying to figure out how to live and raise and keep this little one alive, but also we're planning the next move to the next city and getting sorted with the next team and the next contract and everything. So it's been crazy, but all really, really good stuff. And it's been a really just great week. The last seven, eight days have been, like I said, the best week of my, my life. As you guys already saw, we got the U-Haul. Basically, we're gonna start packing up today, finish packing tomorrow, and then the plan is to leave on Wednesday for the new city. And the cherry on top, your dad's in town. And? <laughs> And as you guys saw, Mimi's mom is here to help us with that first week, and then my parents just flew in for this second week to help us with the whole move up into The house is an absolute mess right now, but it's actually doing pretty well. I know it looks chaotic, but this is what it's looking like. Some boxes out here in the main area. All of the furniture is still here in the main area. We have all of our table and stuff over there a lot of our kitchen stuff that all needs to be packed up, which is gonna be a pain in the ass. Kitchen's looking, or I mean the garage is looking okay. We've already got some boxes out here that we've already kind of packed, but have opened up needing various things while they're in the boxes. So we're gonna fill up this uh, garage with a whole bunch of boxes today. Then I'll show you the other rooms. Here's our guest bedroom. My parents are just sleeping in here right now, helping us pack up everything. So we'll have to, pack up all this stuff. Here is all of the nursery stuff for our new home and the new or our old king mattress. So this room is an absolute disaster, but we're just going to be basically sealing up all these boxes, putting in the final things that we're still using, packing everything up, packing up my clothes, all that kind of stuff, getting that ready. Here's our bedroom right now and it's a disaster. This is the worst our house has ever look like to be honest it's just a mix of the baby coming the move and then also like half packing and getting ready for everything but i'm really really excited to go to the new place very excited to get settled into the new city i'm very excited to start training with my new team i'm very excited to move into our new house and get that set up and actually unbox all the baby stuff and actually set up a nursery for scarlet that would be you know something that Mimi has been looking forward to since she found out she was pregnant and has not been able to do since she kind of knew that we were, you know, not coming back here, unfortunately. So let's get started.
Think we can get this done today? Absolutely. Do we have a choice? We don't have a choice, no. <laughs> Uh, the next morning, we've made really, really good progress. We've pretty much moved everything except for our little suitcases, maybe a couple chairs, the cleaning supplies, and two mattresses. So now we just got to move the mattresses into the mattress like protectors. We're going to move those in the U Haul, and uh, we should be able to get out of here, I think, in an hour and a half. I'm going to shoot for nine o'clock. I think nine o'clock is realistic. <laughs> Here's the U Haul practically packed all the way to the brim. It goes all the way to the top, all the way back there, 20 feet. We probably should have got the one size bigger, but we made it work. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. Okay, you almost ready? Yep, just gotta top her off. <laughs> top her up, what's the phrase? So I don't wanna say how long the drive is, where we're going, all that stuff, because I think that would give, you know, it kind of away. But, uh. I mean, the length could be in any direction though. I know, but st okay. I mean, it's gonna okay. give it away a little okay. bit. So let's give. Let's just say that we're doing a multi-day trip somewhere and we're leaving ah! now. But anyway, guys, I'm gonna end the video here. Hopefully in the next video, we'll be unpacking into the new place and uh, in our new home, in our new city, and I'll be about ready to start with my new team, with my new family. Thank you so much, guys. I really appreciate it. all the love and support. It means a ton. I'm pumped about a little Scarlet over here. And if you guys enjoyed this video, please hit the thumbs up button, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. And sorry there was no workout or soccer content, but this was kind of taking- This uh, was a good workout, actually. Yeah, it was. Honestly, my hamstrings are sore. <laughs>